Hey guys, Angel here. Uh, this is the Spellbook Boutique channel and I wanted to talk to you about witchcraft or the craft in general. Um, that covers paganism, the religion Wicca, and just being a witch in the craft and studying and practicing spell casting, um, circle casting, workings in general. Sorry guys, I had makeup on and it didn't all come off. Um, but I started this channel about seven years ago, um, close to around there, maybe maybe five years ago, two years after I had moved into the apartment that I previously lived in. Um, beautiful apartment and, um, you know, looking for another one. But uh, currently right now I'm at my parents' house, so I can't practice the way that I would like to with my altar and all of my candles and my herbs and uh, my incenses and stuff like that. So um, it's kind of putting a stop in my Wiccan path. And it's kind of frustrating because I miss it. Um, it's something that I, that I believe in. It's something that I truly feel that fulfills me inside. It's something that I love to do. I'm I don't know if, if any of you, those of you who do know me, um, I'm usually on the cheerful side. I'm usually very sweet. I have been in some trouble, so it kind of like some people may think differently, but, um, but there is a darker side to me, I guess you'd say. Um, not that I'm into the evil things in life, not that I'm into you know, breaking the law. I'm very regretful for the things that have happened and, and sorry to the people that they've happened with. And I hope they know that. And if I ever can, I will apologize for anything that I've ever done. But today I've been sitting here trying to think of a YouTube video to put out, trying to think of, you know, what exactly do I do for an upload today and I just decided that I wasn't going to do anything for today and I sat here and I have my cup of coffee I have my other my soda and my diet soda and stuff like that and um, I did a little bit of meditation and it brought wholeness and peace and calm and clarity back into me and usually in today's world we have a lot of confusion and chaos and like I said, because I'm at my parents' house, because of a situation that's um, ongoing, which I'm on my way, tomorrow we'll be leaving around 10. Hopefully we'll get out a little bit earlier to go back to Illinois to finish up some court proceedings and stuff like that and just get things finalized and, and so we can all move on from this situation. And um, nothing major, just some small time stuff, but um, I was sitting here and I, like I said, I had done some meditation and this awakening just came over me of how much I love being a part of the craft and being a part of Wicca and paganism and being a witch and um, studying and learning and practicing my, my path in, in this religion and faith and, and belief. and. I just was watching Sunshine Morning Ray and a couple of other YouTubers that are also into the same thing that I do and follow the same path. And I really miss being able to, because my mother doesn't practice anything. She doesn't believe in, in any sort of one religion or faith. She just kind of lives by the thought that if you want something done, you have to do it yourself. That if you want an outcome to happen you have to make it happen yourself and it's 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 your own doing and she doesn't really like candles or just you know the the open flame and stuff like that bothers her and um, she doesn't like incense she has a very very um, sensitive nose to smells and stuff so I can't really practice my my path here which is fine because they're they're helping me with a place to stay for right now until we can find my new my new home um and i really miss being with 
all of my my craft supplies, my objects, my tools, and just being in a place where I can study. I remember when I was sitting there for the first, because I lived in that apartment for about six, seven years, that I just, at a time, I was sitting there just wishing that I had someone to stay with. But that's the more lonelier side of me, you know, needing a partner or wanting um, a partner in life. But I didn't, during that time in that house, because of the situation and stuff like that, I didn't really get to fully practice properly. I was more in my learning stages where I bought the tools and I bought, I set up the altars and stuff like that and the books and stuff. But I had, like I said, an awakening today where I really fell in love with the natural simplicity of the craft and how naturistic it is and how it is about your own personal power within you and energies and working with the gods and the goddesses and just the divine and believing that as long as you're a good person and you do no harm and and do no harm to others and you know do what you will you know I really just fell in love with it today. I just, I have this yearning to get back into a home or a place where I can just have a space where I can freely practice my my faith or my practice or my belief or my religion in paganism and Wicca and or Neo Wicca and the craft or witchcraft and just be the witch that I want to be and there has been so many people holding me back from that that I wanted to talk to you just not to get you to become part of the craft but just to get an understanding out there because I've had so many people not that they mean harm by it but just because that's their own belief and feeling that it's it's just it's put a lot of stress and strain on my life that I haven't gotten to practice the way that I wanted to and with that awakening that I'm having today and stuff like that I just wanted to let you know that I'm gonna be changing this channel and the feel it's still gonna be called the spellbook boutique channel um, it was formerly angel sky channel which I just don't want to change back and forth to names because sometimes people can't find things if it's not this they know it as one and if you change it then they can't find it anymore so I'm gonna keep it the spellbook boutique boutique channel because it also promotes and supports my Etsy shop but um, I just I just thought I'd film about you know the struggles of want of learning about this and how different it is in America today you know it's just I just wanted to say something about that it's just so many people are so against this religion because it has so much confliction with Christianity from all many thousands or hundreds of years ago in the history of the US that it's just it people feel so strongly about Christianity that it's been taking a toll which is where I'm coming coming from is taking a toll on my practice in the craft and I I'm not gonna let that ha not that I'm gonna take severe action I just am not gonna let that bother me or take control over my practice anymore um, so this channel I wanted to say I'm gonna kind of it's not gonna be a drastic change it's just gonna be more about it's still gonna be about me and my life and the things that I do and stuff like that but it's gonna be, I think I'm gonna put or incorporate some things about my path and stuff like that. I kind of have steered away from that. Um, when I first started it, it was, that's why I started the channel was because I was starting the path of Wicca and learning about it and becoming a witch in the craft and stuff like that. But like I said, I just, I didn't know if I was gonna post today. I didn't know if I was gonna, sometimes I don't know if I'm going to post at all anymore. Um, you know, I've had two more subscribers, which is great. And thank you very much. Shout out to you guys. Um, thank you for subscribing to my channel. 
uh, you know, money is not an issue with me. It's just, it's more of like the, the fun in trying to get the thousand subscribers and just seeing if you can accomplish the goal of getting monetization. Um, but it would, it would definitely help a lot because that way I could do more things for the channel and make them a little bit more, more fun to watch and, and, and exciting because I could do more things. I could meet more people. I could, you know, have more friends. I, I've kind of secluded myself due to just the past, you know, things that have happened. I've, I've stayed away from things and stopped talking to people and not that I'm a hermit, but it would just be nice to to get back into life and share my new path or my new belief or or the more natural way of my living that I choose to live. Because I don't really, the only thing that I do watch is YouTube. Um, I don't really watch TV anymore. I try to cut that out. Um, I try not to be on like iPads and stuff like that unless it has to do with YouTube because that's something that I'm working on is my YouTube channel and, and stuff like that. My Etsy shop is there still. Um, if you want, there's black salt on there. There's Angel's Love Oil. Um, you can get for candle dressing or for cooking or um, you can get uh, um, there's also a couple of other things. There's some bracelets and stuff on there that I've made, um, but I'm working on, that's kind of like, I focused all of my attention on that when it opened, so I stopped doing YouTube for a while. So now I'm back and I'm just, like I said, I'm not here to push anyone aside or top anyone in any type of ranking or subscribing or subscribers. I'm just here to be able to YouTube on YouTube and upload my videos and those of you who who want to watch and follow me and, and get to know me and stuff like that, leave a comment in the comment box and please, I would more than love to hear from you and answer your questions and just chat with you. Um, I only get like 15 minutes so I'm, uh, I'm going to have to go in a couple of minutes because we're at 12 minutes right now. Um, because I have to, this is on my actual camera on my iPad and I can only upload about 15 minutes from YouTube from my camera. So, um, because I did it on here this way, I can edit it if I want to, put some music to it or some sounds and pictures and stuff. But I just wanted to get on and let you guys know that I'm, this channel is going to be a lot about, um, me and and my path that's where i started from with this channel and watching youtube i've kind of like deterred it back and forth from like mukbanging and just trying different things that all of the other big youtubers out there and youtubers in general do um just trying different things and seeing what would help make this channel grow and like i said um you know any of you guys out there you know this YouTube is, monetization has made YouTube kind of like a thing to where people are worried about who they subscribe to. YouTube is a, is a, a social media, media family friendly, you know, kid friendly site and you don't have to worry about who you subscribe to. Um, you know, if you, you can always unsubscribe, it's not that big of a deal and if you ever have any problems and pretty sure we're, we're all adults or we know we can go to our, our adult figures in our life, our mom and our dads, if we ever need help or anything. But um, yeah, you know, it's like, I just, I've had such an awakening today in the craft and it's just, it fulfills me so much. Not that I'm not a believer in God anymore because I am baptized and I'm going to have to go soon. But um uh, yeah, let me end this here and then I'll start another film. So this will be a two-part um, upload. So I'll get back to you in just a minute.